when I walk into a store or when I go online and I'm buying something for myself, I'm constantly looking at these factors that other people might ignore. And I think that now, something that originally was something that I was doing out of curiosity and I like it now, it has reinforced itself because of my study and better understanding of some of the things that are behind the scene. My name is Santiago Galino, I'm an associate professor at TAC and I do research in retail operations. So I think that there are two areas that I like to focus on. The first one is more connected to traditional retail issues. This is something that I will put as store execution. So things that has to do with inventory, staffing levels, the performance of the sales staff in the floor, and all those details that makes a retailer successful. I also like to do research on interaction between the online and the brick and mortar world and how companies are integrating these two channels and making changes in their strategy, how are new players appearing and, and gaining a lot of market with creative and new retail ideas. Instead of opening regular stores, some companies started to open showrooms where you can go and see and touch and try the products they offer online. But if you want to buy, you still need to go to the website. I think that this idea will potentially translate into traditional brick and mortar retailers. In order to be more efficient and reduce cost, they can actually start to offer showrooms, get the benefits of the economies of scale of having all the inventory at a particular place and instead of spread out in the different stores. So I find a lot of synergies between my different roles here at TAC, like if you think about my research activity and my teaching. Interacting with the students always brings to me some uh, fresh perspective on research problems that I'm currently thinking about, or they actually bring new research questions to me. I benefit of the combination of two things, people that had experience working on an industry that I like to study, and so they tell me stories and they challenge my, my research. And also, they have a critical voice to things that I'm doing. And they can always point out to potential flaws or suggestions for things for me to look in the future, and I enjoy that a lot.